Hi, I'm Jim Hendricks with Boating Magazine. Your main battery cables serve as the major tributary serving your boat's 12-volt DC electrical system. Ranging in size from 1 to 4 AWG and gauge, main battery cables include the red positive cable that connects to the battery switch. The black cable connects the battery negative terminal to the common ground bus bar. When it's time to replace cables due to corrosion or other damage, Sierra offers marine battery cables in a variety of lengths and gauges, all pre-swaged and soldered with tin-plated copper terminal lugs. When purchasing replacement parts, make sure they carry a strong factory warranty. Sierra parts, for example, carry a limited lifetime customer satisfaction warranty. In the unlikely event a product fails to comply with the warranty, Sierra will replace or repair that product free of charge. Batteries pack a lot of energy, so exercise caution when replacing cables. If you don't feel comfortable with boat do-it-yourself projects, seek out the help of a local marine service shop to help you with this. Okay, the rest of you DIYers, let's get started. First, take off any metal jewelry to help prevent electrical shorts or injury. Turn off the battery switch and take care not to cross the terminals with metal tools. Disconnect and remove the negative cable first from the battery and then the bus bar. Next, remove the positive cable from the battery and the battery on off switch. Replacement cables should be the same size and length, so look on the insulation for an imprint showing the AWG size number. Next, measure the length of the old cables. Once you have your new cables, make sure all the terminals are clean and free of corrosion. Apply a coating of dielectric grease to the terminals and the cable lugs to inhibit corrosion. Then reinstall the cables, starting with the positive. Make sure all terminal connections are tight. And for safety, be sure the positive battery terminal is protected by a terminal cover. Next, turn the battery on-off switch to on and make sure you have power. Maintenance is important. And now that you've replaced all your battery cables with fresh ones, you're ready to get back out on the water. For Boating Magazine, I'm Jim Hendricks.